Hello everyone, welcome back to another video in the series of 50 days 50 questions. I hope your preparation is going well. We are here on day number 50 in the series which is the last video for the series of 50 days 50 questions. I hope uh, you have watched the previous videos and uh, gotten your concepts cleared. If not, please go back and do watch the previous videos. So the question for today is that a worker's wage, it's mentioned in 1996 year, is Rs. 180. So what should be the wage in 1999 so that the worker remains at the same level of uh, consumption? You have to consider this price index that is already given for different years. You have to consider 1995 as the base, so that's why the index is 100 here. And you have to find that what would be the wage in 1999 so that he remains at the same level of consumption as he was in 1996. Options given are 237, 727, 37, 247, 257. What should be his wage? So if you know how to solve such questions, pause the video right now, solve it. Okay, if not, then proceed with me. So what are we going to do? First, let's find out what is the worker's real income. Okay. Because that is only going to tell you that, you know, he's at the same level of, you know, the consumption, the real income, not the money income, right? Because you have to adjust his income with the price index. So if I have to calculate in 1996, what is his real income? It's going to be the whatever is his money income in 1996 divided by his, uh, the price index in 1996, right? So money income in 1996 is already given to us which is 180, right? And what would be the price index? Price index is here, 110. If you write in decimal form, it's actually 1.1, right? So this is going to give you your real income, which is going to be equal to if you divide this you have 163.63 approximately is the real income of the worker right now let me see what would be his real income in 1999 year so real income in 1999 would again be money income divided by whatever is the price index in that year so money income, we actually don't know what it is, right? So let's say it's X. Now this divided by whatever is the price index is 1.45 here, right? So for him to stay at the same level of consumption, the real income in 1996 should be equal to the real income in 1999. So we have X upon 1.45 so it should be equal to 163.63 right now I solve this and I have x to be equal to 237.27 so this should be actually his money wages that's what we had to find out hence the right answer is option a I hope you understood this do uh, give me your feedback in the comments of this video how you liked the series of 50 days 50 questions if you have any queries you can call us here thank you